Hey, what's up everyone? I'm Naughty Llama here, and I've got uh, some MLB The Show. This is the new franchise I'm going to do here. I'm going to use the Dodgers, and you can see they have, uh, they have an alright team. they got pretty good pitching and defense. Their batting isn't the greatest. There, I leave all the uh, default settings alone. I don't turn on, like, forced trades or budgets or anything like that, because I think I turned on, uh, I turned budgets off last time I did franchise, but the Dodgers already have a lot of money. I think they spend, like, 100 million bucks a year, so, uh, we didn't have to turn it on. And here, I was just looking at the uh, free agents, seeing if I needed anybody, um, there was some good free agent pitching, but I didn't want to really uh, spend more money on starting pitching because my rotation's pretty good. I think I signed a relief pitcher. I wanted to get a uh, lefty because my bullpen only had one lefty, so I think I get Domus So Marty or however you pronounce his name. Uh, he played for the Yankees last year. He's a pretty good uh, like seventh or eighth inning guy, so that helped me out here. I think I just go into my uh, roster here in a second and delete somebody, but yeah, I was looking at my bullpen. You can see I only had one lefty, though I, I thought it would be smart to sign another one because it would... Uh, Kind of help me out. I think you should have at least two left-handed pitchers in your bullpen. And then my starting rotation has a lot of lefty. I think it goes, uh, I think I have two or three left-handed pitchers in my starting rotation. So I switch them off, like lefty, right, left, right. So that's kind of good. Uh, keeps teams having to use different lineups and stuff so they can't use the same guys all the time. So I signed him to a two-year deal. I think I signed him to uh, two million bucks a season. Yeah, I go, uh, he won't take anything less than uh, 4.02 million. So, uh... It's not. It's still a pretty low salary for him. I got a nice uh, relief pitcher for that. So uh, my starting rotation is really good. I got Clayton Kershaw and uh, Chad Billingsby at the top, who are all really good. And then Ted Lilly is pretty good too. So I got a really good uh, starting three. So my first game here is against the uh, San Diego Padres. And there, I think my overall was. Uh, I think it was like rated the 19th uh, team out of uh, everyone in baseball. So still need to. Uh, I don't know. Probably sign some uh, batters or something. But I'm probably gonna wait till the trade deadline to go after some people. I think. Uh, I should try to get a third baseman and a catcher is what I really needed. My catcher wasn't the greatest. My third baseman, uh, he was decent, but he wasn't too good. My shortstop and stuff, they're not the best overall, but they, uh, they're pretty young, a lot of my players, so I think I'll try to give them like time to develop over the season. So here, uh, we're in the first inning. There's a nice uh, out to second there, so I get, kind of get screwed there. So I got Matt Kemp up, which I think I don't get any hits with him this game, which kind of sucks, but uh, Kemp's a really good player. He probably should have won there strike out with him. Um, he probably should have won the uh, MVP last year, but they gave it to Braun just because he was on a better team. I think Kemp had uh, better numbers last year. He had like 39 or 40 home runs and like 100 and some RBIs, so he's a really good player. And then I have Ethier batting behind him, which is pretty good. So if they walk Kemp, I get another uh, strong batter behind him. So I'm pitching uh, Clayton Kershaw here, who won the uh, Cy Young last year. He's a really good pitcher. I think his ERA was like a 2-2 or something ridiculous last year, so... Trying to throw low fastballs here at this guy's knees, see if I can try to get him to chase. I get him in a 1-2 uh, count here, and uh, he'll foul that off, so he'll just stay alive. So, Yeah, I think uh, the Dodgers will be a pretty good team for me, because once I start winning with them, they uh, they have they actually that guy out. But they have money, so they can uh, I can re-sign players and stuff, because I was looking at teams like Oakland and uh, Seattle. I wanted to do them, but I don't know. Once you get those teams good, they're such a small market team. They don't really have any money, so... Even if you start winning with him, like I don't know how I could resign Felix Hernandez or anything like that with Seattle, because uh, he's a really good player, but they really don't uh, spend the money for it. So the Dodgers, it's kind of nice that they spend money. They have a really big budget here, so um, I don't know. The Dodgers will probably be good, in, like if not this year, I think in the near future, because they got Magic Johnson. He uh, co-owned them, which is uh, pretty cool that they get new owners now, because their old owners kind of sucked. But there they get a uh, solo home run in the first inning, which kind of sucks. It's not the uh, well, I wanted to start off this game, so I think I go to a uh, slider here, which uh, they hit that to uh, right field. So there's an out. So that'll end the first inning. Uh, it's uh, one nothing San Diego. Not that big of a deficit, but still kind of sucks to give up a run like that really early. So we'll go to the bottom of the second here. Kershaw, like I said, he's a really good pitcher. He's throwing like 95 mile an hour fastballs for me, which um, I was doing a road to the show thing, which they're kind of boring to watch, but uh. I finally got my guy up to uh, AAA. I think I'm in the second season, and I signed him to like a or uh, he signed a uh, one million dollar contract. Which uh, I'm actually with the Dodgers in my road to the show. I think I was drafted by uh, by Detroit, and they ended up trading me in the first season. So I am in the uh, starting ha or the uh, top spot in my AAA roster. So I'm gonna put some videos up on that once I get into uh, into the pros. There, I'm not sure if anyone wants to watch uh, road to the show or not. They're kind of boring, so. Here they got two on with no outs, which uh, kind of hurts me here. I want to try to get this guy out. I don't want him to get a base hit. So uh, he will hit one uh, deep, and it's a uh, three-run homer. So that really uh, really hurts me. It's still the second inning, and they've got a 4 nothing lead. So 
That hurts. I think I simulate all the pitching after this inning and just go for the batting. Here I'll get a guy to uh, pop out here, so that'll end the inning. Um, I don't know. It's four nothing though, which kind of sucks because uh, it's really early, so it's gonna be hard for me to overcome that deficit. But I don't know. Um, we'll go to uh, the top half of the fourth. I get my guy in a full count here, and I pop up to uh, deep right field for the first out there. So that kind of sucks. Um, I don't know what else to talk about really. This video is kind of long. Oh, I saw Ozzy G and the uh, Marlins uh, general manager got suspended for five games, which, uh, I don't know, I'm not, like, Mexican or anything, so I wasn't really offended by what he said, but I don't know if anyone really was or not. I know uh, Miami has a lot of guys from, uh, or not Mexican, but Cuban, so you know, they got a lot, of guys, a lot of guys from Cuba down there, so I don't know uh, if it was really uh, super offensive or not, but, I don't know, five games seems like a lot to me. I think it was just, like, something dumb he said, so, uh... And I, I think not suspending him would have been fine as long as he apologized like he did. I think that was fine. I think it was a little overkill to suspend him five games. I don't know what everyone else thinks or not, but um, I don't know. The Marlins aren't doing as good as I thought they were. I'm surprised that uh, one team that's kind of stuck in so far is the Phillies just because uh, they really don't have any offense right now because everyone's injured. They have, uh, what's the dude's name? They have uh, Pence in the outfield who's pretty good, but they don't have uh, Utley or Howard, so that's going to hurt them. I don't know how long they're hurt for, but... Uh, I don't know, it'll be interesting to see how Philly can do. They get really good starting pitching, but they really don't have uh, any offenses. So they lost uh, two, or they lost a series to the Pirates, two games to one, and then they uh, they lost to the Marlins the other day. So um, here we go to the top half of the seventh. It's 5 nothing. They scored another run. So I got Matt Kemp up, and this dude absolutely robs me there in center field. I don't know how he dove for that. Um, Let's do the replay. This was just a ridiculous catch right here. Kind of sucked that I got screwed out of that. What well, should have been a, probably a double. Um, yeah, so we got Ethier up here in the top of the seventh. Uh, two outs. This really isn't the best opening day game for me right here, especially since San Diego is uh, not that good of a team. And there's a deep hit, but a fly out to left. So that'll end the, uh, in the seventh inning there. So I'm still down 5 nothing, which uh, sucks. I don't know if... Uh, Kershaw gave up the run or not. Like I said, I simulated the pitching, so not 6 nothing. so yeah, I don't know if my relievers gave up the other two runs or my starter did, but uh, here I will uh, get a base hit to right. That'll just stay in, and I'll bounce off that guy's glove, which uh, if he would have missed that, I would probably get a double there, but uh, he blocked it, so it's a uh, small it's base hit, so I'll pinch hit here um, in my pitcher. Let me see who I bring in. Uh, I think I bring in Uribe. I'm not sure. Let me see. Yeah, bringing your rebra to hit here since they have a left-handed pitcher up. So um, I threw someone in my bullpen just because uh, I had took my pitcher up. I really wasn't expecting to come back from this game since it's uh, it's six six nothing. So there I will uh, pop out to center for the uh, first out. I think so. Uh, got to run around first with one out. So I really uh, I don't know. I was trying to do something here. I really didn't have a chance to win it all here. Get my lead off. Uh, guy D Gordon up who's my shortstop who this guy is pretty young but he's really good he's really fast and uh he's got great contact and stuff but there I uh line one right to third base so there's the second out so uh I wanted to try to get a base hit with uh this guy here so I can bring up Kemp again see if I can get something with him so uh I will uh get a deep hit here and I think that actually stays stays fair yeah that's a uh it's a double that'll stay uh or it'll bounce over the wall for a uh ground will double there so my runner has to stay at third so uh I got two outs here, but I got Matt Kemp up, so I want to see if I can uh, break this shutout here. And yeah, I will uh, hit one the short, and that'll just, uh, just the throw will just beat me, so I ground out there. So opening day kind of sucked for me there. I uh, lost 6 nothing, but um, I think I simulated the rest of the series. Or I played game two, and I think I lost that, but I simulated the rest of the series, and uh, we split it 2-2 two -two because it was a four-game series. So the next video I'll put out is, uh, I think, on the home opener against the Pirates. So I uh, add some... Uh, off to play those games, but yeah, their uh, starting pitcher went nine innings, just uh, four hits for me there. He had a pretty good game, so it was a really uh, not so good game for me there. That's it, guys. Um, I'll try to put up the next video in a couple of days, so um, all right, bye.